see this Nerf gun skin for $5.40. I'm pretty sure it's um, normally 20. Okay. And that tote right there is heavy. I believe that I got toys in it, but I can't get up there. We have all that. What about the little bowling set? And I've already looked down here kind of quickly though. And then I'll shop for clearance toys. I see Penny Medicine, but I gotta go. Something told me to come back here. It's only the Gildan though, not the Hanes or the Fruit of the Loom. So you gotta look through them because there's Gildan shirts that's mixed in. See look, that's Fruit of the Loom, that's Bobby Brooks. But they see it as the same color, so they put them all in the same darn box as Hanes. If you see Gildan, scan it as Fruit of the Loom. It's most likely a Penny baby. And see, I just scanned one of each color, but I was like, wait a minute. Um, let me look through these because some of them look the exact same, but they're different brands. Bobby Brooks. Look at different colors down here. Fruit of the Loom, Fruit of the Loom. Especially in those whites, they were really mixed in. have to wait however long it takes me to upload this and sometimes it's days so i got a pink square there i got a blue dot i got another blue dot this was already on here i don't even know if that's the right tag for these gonna be wrapped up for my baby this is perfect timing honey Was that the right tag? Because, girl, it was already on the teddy bear. I scanned and I said. Yeah, it was on the teddy bear. I've seen it days ago. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I was God. like, I ain't put it on there. I don't know. But, no, oh, wait. <laughs> that rung up for $15. What's mm -hmm. on there? Is that no dot? Oh, that's the one I supposed to put back. I price checked it. I'm sorry. There was no dot on there. I was going to price check it. I forgot about it. And I was supposed to price check that, too. So, uh, Can I get you to take this off? So, they're like 15 bucks and they're a cent. <laughs> <laughs> are there any more left or are they all gone? You know, you're supposed to get them all because y'all supposed to go pull them after we leave the register. Yeah. So, that's why we always take them all. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I need to first check that. First check this. First check this. Thank you. You can have it, because I don't want it. I'm just mm -hmm. buying it. What am I going to do with it? Nothing. I don't even know what I'm going to do with it. I just thought it was cute. Yeah. Okay, the thing is on the bottom of this. This is green dye of, of Gildan t-shirts. You could do it at the end if you want. Because, yeah. No, please do it at the end. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Just ring them all up, and then you could leave them up there and do them at the end. Okay. Yeah, because it takes too long to take them off individually. The last store, they took like 10 minutes. They could not get those things off my hats. <laughs> and I was like, I almost left them there. Price check these really quick. Oh, there's the water balloon. Eight count. 
I might not even have enough. I have to go to the car. So I got 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Y'all got pennies back there somewhere? I'm trying to have an extra penny. I know I don't on my register. Oh, I found a nickel. So I might have enough. How much is it? Yeah, it's 17 cents, right? Yes, it is. Yeah, I got enough. Okay. Um, Y'all have enough for that? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. Yeah, Y'all hate when people put change on the counter because some cashiers say they hate that and I be trying not to do that. But no, I was just counting it out. Not really. It's when you put like cash and then the change like toss it. Oh, no. See, tossing it, that's crazy and rude. Yeah. Like, I ain't no dog. Don't toss nothing to me. You basically telling me to go sit. I think this is my favorite haul for this month and... I think last month too, just because I got my baby some toys. And I've been looking for toys for since they penny. And I haven't been able to buy anything. Yeah. Yes. You don't mind putting this back only because I'm in a rush. I always put my stuff back. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. And look, I forgot to look for the candy, but it's okay. The candy? Yeah. Right back there. No, no, no. The penny candy. Oh. <laughs> What's up, YouTube friends, family, associates, subscribers, and members? I'm going to show you this haul. I'm going to try to be as quick as possible. This is probably one of my best hauls and favorite hauls this month, um, only because of these bad babies right here. I was trying so hard to find Blue Dot toys. Um, even found one today. I had a huge haul today as well. I'm trying to catch up on these videos, baby. But they just keep coming. It just, they, and that's a good thing, okay? So, um, after I upload this part two from yesterday, I believe it was, I would start uploading part one, two, and probably three. It's probably going to be four parts. This was a long video and only two stores. That's how big the next haul is. Okay. So, I got a pink square. Remember um, what I said throughout the video? Hopefully, you were paying attention and watched all parts. If you didn't, I'm sorry. I will not be repeating anything anymore at the end of the video unless it's something that I said in the store where you could not hear me five four eight nine you really don't need the upc number you just need to look for pink square um if you're watching this video in november of 2024 because today is the what 16th yes because q's birthday was two days ago thank you again for all the birthday wishes for my son and q his sweet 16 was on november 14th but anyway yes if you're watching this video in november these pink squares should still be a penny now, if you just happen to see it next year around summertime again 2025 those are probably going to be new pink squares okay for the year 2025 i got this color and erase i believe i missed a few of these in the store tonight but my phone was at the register charging i know i felt something sticky it's something on here last word of the upc number 5135 if i don't read them off just pause the video and look okay here is a green clover. I almost said green dot because sometimes they have these little ice cubes in green dots. Green clover is also a penny. However, there are some green clover candles and other items. Please be careful. Always scan those green clover, clover candles and wall decor and stuff like that are not a penny. Only the little wood knocks and things like this. This green clover with tags like this. Those are a penny, okay? the stockings um you can find these in the clearance aisle 4079 um the reese's shout out to whoever told me about the reese's but i believe they said a different one and i just happened to scan this one with the cereal in it and it was a penny okay um i don't know if i got these by the register or on an end cap i believe yeah i got these by the register and it says they expired this month 2024 9154 the last four of the upc number <clears throat> i got a few of those as you can see the little b12 chewable things i got two different packs there's one right there <clears throat> 2207 last four i got these sort of near the register ew i don't know what maybe they're i don't know if these are any good it looks like they're melting and it's all sticky ew <clears throat> yeah so hopefully you saw that upc number I got this, um, I guess it's taco sauce. Last word of the UPC number is 0982. Let's see the expiration, focus. 
um, Best Buy September 2024. So technically they're expired, but <clears throat> I'm sure there's still some good. I may donate these to the shelter. Um, I found these on the clearance aisle, but always check the regular aisle as well, okay? Because you will get lucky. Um, these, this chunky soup, spicy chicken and sausage gumbo. If you watch part one, then you will see where I showed you one that looks exactly like that and what to look out for. So you won't make the mistake of getting the full price one. If there's a reason you can't scan. Oh, no tag on that one. I got this garlic extract. Extract. Um, if you see number 1494. I know that was blurry, so I had to look outside the camera to read it. Here's the yellow dot. Remember all yellow dot shoes, clothes, and accessories. That means bracelets, pins, backpacks, purses. Um, this is a cooling towel. Okay, so this is an accessory. Yellow dot. It's a penny. So don't get it confused with yellow dot toys. It's only yellow dot shoes, clothes, and accessories, okay? And flip-flops are excluded except for the ones with that certain tag on it that um, I showed you. 7620. Again, if you're ever unsure, just scan. The app will tell you. If the app says ten dollars, then it's ten dollars. If it says zero dot zero zero, then it's a penny. I got these bamboo scores. I also showed you guys some another pack that looks almost similar to this. So make sure again you're watching the entire video and not fast forwarding, or you will not learn. Um, last for the UPC number is seven three nine one. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. I give the last four of the UPC numbers just in case you're in the store and you cannot scan or you can't connect to that Wi-Fi, whatever the case may be. You can always pause my video, take a screenshot of the UPC number. And if you're in the store and you're like, dang, I think I saw these in Shadi's video, but I can't scan it. Um, let me go to my photos. My photo says the UPC number for these scores and N7391 and the ones I see right here on the shelf. 7391. Yay, found me a penny item. That's the reason why I give them to you, okay? This chalkboard. Shout out to the person that pointed this out. I can't believe it was still there two or three days later. This is a green clover, okay? So it'll also have this star on it as well. Like, you see this one got the green star and the green clover. If you see items like this, those are penny as well. Okay, little mini chalkboard. So now I got two chalkboards. I got the super big one, the purple dot one, and I got the little mini one, okay? Um, no tag on the slinky, which I believe that's a yellow dot, but they let me get it. And I say that because I saw them today with yellow dots on it. I got a pink square here. Pink square is summer. There are a few exclusions to pink square. So once again, make sure you're scanning. And I've showed you guys the exclusions throughout my videos so you won't make the mistake of throwing them in your cart. I can never find the UPC number or the barcode on this box, even when I was in the store. This one is in 5908, but again, all you need to look for is the pink sticker. However, sometimes you will find items where people have peeled off the sticker. Keep that in mind, okay? You might be walking right by a penny item and somebody done peeled it off, so now you don't know it's a blue dot. So if it looks familiar, even if it doesn't have a sticker, scan it, okay? Um, this right here, I believe I got a two for one. I don't know, because it looks like there's another base in here, but I couldn't get it out when I pulled it. I pulled some of the flowers out, see? <laughs> and it's like stuck down here. Um, but this one, the outside base, you grow, girl. I know that's right, is a green dot. And I had they scan this. I don't know. That would have been full price. I don't know. I didn't scan this, so I don't know if it's a penny or not, but it may be. I believe she scanned this. That's a green dot. Okay, so we're looking for green dot and green clover. Okay. Um, Here's another green dot. True Living little tea glass mug thingy. This teddy bear, I'm pretty sure it was not a penny, but it doesn't have the tag on it. This is the tag that was already on it. Whatever this tag is, I scanned it and it said a penny. So I don't remember which picture came up, but if you guys want to type it in on the app, see if anything comes up or take a screenshot and grab another phone and scan it and let me know what it is, please let me know. But 
you guys heard her at the register. She was like, yeah, I believe you because I saw that sticker on that bear a few days ago. And I scanned it and it was a penny. So she just went on ahead and gave me the bear for a penny because it do got a penny tag on it. <laughs> okay. I got some Gildan shirts and I probably got over 100 of these today. That's why I said I got a big haul coming up, baby. Um, look for Gildan. However, there are some Gildan shirts that are full price. So make sure you are scanning, okay? I'm just showing you the colors of what to look for. One is about why did you get V-neck? Like gear, or you know if it's a penny, I'ma just get it. Gildan, Gildan, Gildan. And some of them are mixed in with the Hanes shirts. So don't look on top and you see something say Hanes and be like, okay, no, those aren't it. Look through just like this. That's how I found these. They were all mixed in. Take your time and look, okay? Um, shout out to the person that pointed these out, okay? These were initially by this chalkboard in the same store. And somebody pointed these out to me. They weren't in the same spot. They had hung them up with the other tights, which I'm glad they did. Um, this green star, if you find any leggings with the green star on it, scan it. So green dots. Okay, green clover and green star. Green is the lucky color, no pun intended with the clover. <laughs> All right, um, oh, that didn't have a tag, so they're letting me get that as well. All right. Now let's get down to the nitty gritty, my favorite of all. Drum roll. Hey, my baby alive. There are so many different baby alives out there with different price tags on them and different shapes and different colors. There's blue dots. Um, there's blue star. There's yellow dots. Someone commented in my last video, under my last video, and said it's not just blue dot toys. It's also blue star and yellow dot Yes, I know that, but I haven't found any yellow dots or blue star toys thus far. Um, but I did find blue dot, which is so strange because these have been in penny for a little minute, I believe. And um, yeah, they were all sitting there on the shelf, on the bottom shelf. And I've been in that store several times since blue dot toys penny. So you see what I mean? I miss items. You know, I, I couldn't walk in there and say, oh, they ain't got no pennies. They pulled them on. No, I just didn't find them or I just didn't look good. I totally forgot about this aisle. So typically, I believe most Dollar Generals has like three aisles with toys on it. And I only went down that one until I was heading, I think, to the medicine. And I looked to my right and it was a whole row full of toys. And that's where I found these. So this one is a blue dot. Sunshine Love, baby. The UPC number on here and Zen 5407. Okay, hey girl. So that's one. And I believe this is the same one. Let's see. 5407. Yes, it is. So I got two of the same dolls. And then this one. And they're both blue dots. Okay, it has a blue dot on it. All right. And then this one has a blue dot. Original price for that one is 15. This one says 12. Okay, she can go in the water too, as you can see. And UPC number ends in 2840 on this one. <clears throat> and then I got another one. I was telling Lonnie all the black ones were full price, but my baby don't care. But it would have been nice to get one that represents her and look like her, but they don't care. And Alani was like, well, this one's almost black. I was like, yeah, this one looks like you. A little bit, a little light skin, nini, nani. Okay, original price, $15 on this one as well. See, they have some with the full box that's covering the doll. They have some that's partially, and they have some with no bottom on it. Like, it's, they got a ton of Baby Alive, so make sure you're checking and scanning. Again, even if you don't see a dot, because it could be peeled off. Um, 5445, this one ends in. Okay. And that is my penny haul. Let me go ahead and show y'all this receipt, these two receipts. And then we are up out of here, darlings. All right, here is this beautiful receipt um stepping stone kit that is the pink square right there so just to show you that um my receipt have my receipts have the upc number on them as well as well as your receipts 
This is the stepping stone, as you can see, pink square. UPC number in in 5908, correct? All right. And the first item here, it says UPC number ends in 5908, all right? So that's how you guys know I'm looking at the correct receipt. And also, if I ever forget to show you the UPC number and you need or want it, it's always on my receipts because I always show the receipts because my name is who? Sade with the what? Receipts. You got it. Okay, Sunshine Love, that's one of the dolls. Um, Two at one cent each. 5540. So I'm curious, is that the same two? 55407. Yep. All right. So. That says 5540. So the seven is on the end. I don't know. But um, yeah, one cent, one cent, one cent. My little glass tea mug, one cent. Some V-neck shirts, scoop, V-neck scoop. One cent, one cent, two at one cent, two cents. 80 count water balloons. I think that's the first item I showed you right there, which was the pink square. Okay, one cent. My subtotal on yesterday november 15 2024 was 16 cents and florida was petty enough to charge me one cent in tax so my total sale out the door and out the store was 17 cents that's that receipt and here is the last one i don't know if they're in order or not i don't know if i went to that store first or second here i got four packs of the 50 count bamboo scores four at one cent each totaling four cents UPC number ends in 7391. When I have this um, flash on, it just does not focus. And there's the UPC number, 7391, okay, for the scores. Um, oh, they're called kebabs, Lonnie. I just thought about it. Kebabs. I think. We were trying to think, what is it called when you put, like, meat and vegetables on the scores and stuff? I think they're called just kebabs or something like that. Um, there's the toria sauce i guess the um taco sauce that i was telling you about five at one cent each yes i got a total of five one two three four five um the cooling towel one cent one cent one cent for the receipt um candy four cents four at one cent each four cents the stockings um crayola set yeah and this was yesterday as well, November 15, 2024. My subtotal was 26 cents. And Florida was so petty to charge me one cent in tax. Like, really? So my total sale out the door and out the store was 27 cents. Again, on yesterday, November 14, 2024. Y'all let me know what your favorite item is from my haul right here. Um, if you got some of the same items, if there's something in this haul that you would like to find, um... Yeah, let me know, y'all. I mean, I just told you what was my favorite, and I was going to put these up and wrap them up and put them up under the tree for Christmas, but they already done been through my bag. So, y'all let me know in the comment section below. Should I punish them and not give these to them and give it to somebody else's child since I told them not to come in my room and not to go through those bags? And they took them out the bags and left the evidence. They were still outside the bags when I came back home. They ain't even put them back to pretend like they ain't even looking at them. So y'all let me know. Should I still let the two little ones have it, my seven-year-old and four-year-old, or should I um just go ahead and give them away? All right. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Um, it's free. It takes a second. If you're not getting notifications, sometimes you have to unsubscribe and subscribe again. I hate to tell people to unsubscribe because you might forget in that half a second to hit subscribe again. But um, sometimes people do that. It. I don't know why people don't get notifications. I don't know if youtube thinks you guys are robots because you're not active on my channel and sometimes that's what happens and they'll sometimes remove you as a subscriber if you're not liking and commenting and all that stuff i need engagement on facebook and youtube three words or more emojis do not count i'm sorry not my rules social media's rules um but yes hit the notification bell click all if you want to be notified for anything i upload that means videos and community posts and lives Hit all. You, when you hit the bell, it's going to give you um, options. If you want to hit all or personalize, like, uh, I just want videos or I just want posts, you know, you got to hit all. Please give the video a thumbs up, meaning like it. A lot of you watch my videos, but only a handful of y'all like. And it might be always be like that, but I just don't understand it. Like, why even come over here if you don't want to give my video a thumbs up? 
Because like I say, y'all just want to come over here to be nosy, get the little information, and don't want to support your girl. If you don't like me like that, you can't get me to um, watch somebody that I don't like. I don't care what they showing. Okay? I really don't. If I'm going to watch them, even if I don't like them, I'm going to support and give a thumbs up because they just helped me save money or give me information that I wanted or needed. If you dislike it, hell, I always tell you, give a thumbs down. I'm real. If you dislike it, give it a thumbs down. Just give me some type of feedback to let me know how I'm doing. Also, please tell a friend to tell a friend about Sade with the receipts. Don't forget to follow me on Facebook, TikTok, and YouTube. The only one I do not post on is Instagram. I see the thousands of requests sent to Instagram. I'm sorry I made that my personal page. I had to get rid of one to keep my sanity, and Instagram was one of them. May open it back up one day. I'm not sure yet. Um, last but not least, please share, share, share if you dare, honey. And I will see you guys in the next video. Toodles.